What we're really gonna do what is, is we're that? Gonna... Here, let me see this. What up though? So today we're actually gonna talk about the vlog setup. I know a lot of you guys have been wondering how I shoot my vlogs on an iPhone and what the kit consists of. So today we're gonna meet up with Steph Muir, a Detroit YouTuber and fashion blogger and help her build what I call the Venomal Stand. And today's hack will be the Venomal Kit because we're gonna piece some things together. And we're gonna go over a little bit about why the Venomal Kit, the great design, for some people, why it's good for Steph Muir and why it might be good for some of you guys. So, that's it. Let's dive. All right, so we're here. About to get my stuff fixed. As you can see, my hair looks a mess. But my man Sebastian Jackson and his wife got the uh, social club. It's a banger. If you ever come to the D and you need your stuff together, it's amazing. Check it out. As you can see, it's pretty awesome in here. It looks fantastic. I think I'm gonna sit right there. This is cool. Oh, this is enough space for another person, a lady or a man, your preference. But... So, this rug, that rug, 100 years old. What you think? Is I'm fresh? Is I'm clean? Is I'm together? Did he do me right? Did he get it together? If y'all ever in Detroit, you have to have one of these marvelous people and one of these chairs come get your life right. Not only men, women too. Come get your hair washed, get your face done, get your hair cut, get tampered. And now, let's go see Steph. That's good. So right now, we're about to go catch up with Steph Muir coffee shop here in Royal Oak, right outside of Detroit, and order some products, get to learn about her a little bit, and learn why she thinks the Venomal Kit will work for her, and why it might also work for you. For you that don't know, uh, we're going to reintroduce Steph Muir here in Detroit. Uh, she's actually running out to California tomorrow, to, tomorrow morning. Just found um, out this morning. So by moving a day later yeah so by the time you see this she'll be in california so hit her up yes. uh, she's probably gonna hang out with us at uh vidcon yeah. this year yeah. but that's another story today uh can you tell us a little bit about uh what is dress code and who is steph muir yes and like why so the dress code is my blog it's the kind of the name of my brand um eventually i want to make it into an online boutique but right now it's just my fashion blog I give fashion tips, I do a lot of outfit of the days, I'll do um, YouTube videos on fashion. So that's kind of where Steph Muir comes in because my website is called stephmuir.com. So I started a YouTube channel just called Steph Muir. And like I said, I do a lot of fashion on there. Um, and it's basically just gonna be like a lifestyle channel. I'm gonna do health, I'm gonna do fitness, beauty tips, vlogs, daily vlogs. So I was really struggling to find the perfect camera for all of this and thought I needed to spend thousands and thousands of dollars on camera equipment, which you definitely don't need to do when you're starting a YouTube channel. If you get to eventually, once you start growing your brand and have the money to, then that's great, but you definitely don't need it to 
start off and thank God I met him because he introduced me to the perfect setup. Tell us a little bit about your Instagram. What's your handle? Steph Mir. Yep. All my accounts, my Instagram is Steph Mir, my Facebook is Steph Mir, right my website is Steph Mir, right and my YouTube is Steph Mir. So what, why do you think that this setup is good for you? What do you think about the, the Venomal or the Vlog Minimal right. vlogging kit? Well, you know, vlogging is something you want to do on the go. You don't want to have to, it shouldn't ever be like a hassle for you to carry around your equipment and make sure you have a place to put it. And this setup is super compact and it fits seriously wherever. Um, you can put it wherever, you can attach it to poles and chairs and all sorts of things. So you can really use it wherever you are, which is perfect for me just because I don't really know when I'm gonna wanna vlog something. So I wanna show you know as much as my life as possible in my vlogs, so it's perfect for that. Right on. Now something that I haven't introduced her to, she knows about but she hasn't seen in action, is one extra thing that I never really talked to you guys about. And it's this, it's a trigger um, so you can activate your phone, your video camera, your pictures, uh, without necessarily being close to your phone. So you can do a lot of shoots, video shots, or photo shoots by yourself if you're using your phone. This is a trigger that I always have with me. My uh, Apple Watch actually allows me to do so from my watch. So you guys know how I feel about that. I think this is Amazing. probably the coolest thing I'm able to do yeah. on my phone. But for people who don't have an Apple Watch, like Steph, this is the next best thing. Being able to trigger your phone, or your, uh, trigger your videos or your photos without being locked in. So now we're just gonna jump in and order some of these pieces for her. She already has the Akron tripod mount. But we want to get her an extra mount for her phone and order a mic and this trigger. So we're gonna hop in and do that. And right when now. you say trigger, do you mean like you can hit play? We can hit record. Record, okay. And uh, photos. And photos. All for under $100. Now that we have her gear here, we check it out and see how the audio on her camera sounds with and without the mic. Currently, I am using my brand new vlogging equipment. It's so easy to use. There's a microphone that's right on top, a really light and movable tripod. And then I also have my microphone plugged in, so it's better quality and it's just so much easier to use. And I can bring it anywhere I want. So we finished building Steph Muir's Venomal kit. She's about to run out to California. By the time you see this, she'll be in California. So hit her up, so collab. She has a really dope style. Uh, really cute girl, really bubbly, really excited, really positive. I am strongly encourage you, go follow, go subscribe, get familiar. Um, if you're interested in building this kit, links below. Um, I think it's something that a lot of you guys will find extremely beneficial and really, really work for your aesthetic and keep you low drag uh, without running around with a big DLSR, especially if you use your DSLR like I do. To recap, went to the social club, met up with Steph Muir, did the BTS for a photo shoot, built her Venomal kit, to help her better tell her story on the go while she's out in California or traveling wherever she is, getting better video and audio and control of her images as she creates her vlogs. All the links below for you guys if you wanna build that yourself. And since we built something from a bunch of different pieces, that's our hack for the day. And now for the call to action. What do you guys think the future of vlogging will be like? Is it going to be more intricate devices to use your DSLR to better vlog? Or are we going to see a new wave of vloggers trying to have less things on them, but still get really good quality? Leave the comments below. And with that said, it's about that time. And I'd like to thank you for yours. If you like the vlog, please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment below of your favorite design flaws in your neighborhood. And I'd like to invite you to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I love you guys' comments and I read them every day. Design is a basic human need and a human right. So remember, define, design, repeat.
almost forgot. These feet. When you buy this, you're gonna wanna take these little rubber pieces off and super glue them. This is my second Akron smartphone tripod and the feet come off. That is glue. I've had to glue this back on, but once you glue it, it's fantastic. But Akron, can we work on making these that don't need glue? Thanks.